You stole Pocky? I didn't steal it. It was all gonna be thrown away, okay? Or I don't know. I don't know where it would have gone, okay? So yeah. But guys, it's Pocky or Pepero Day because the date is 11 11. So it's like 6 6 6 6. 6 6 6 6. So in Korea, it's a great capitalistic holiday to sell as much pocky as possible it's like valentine's day so a lot of friends and stuff will like buy pocky boxes and there's like a section where you can write notes in the back adonica thanks for the 397 what did you say tina please sing all of prima donna girl oh, guys i'm adonica i'm not a singer i can't do that that's just not possible also auto tune chops and screws up like weird parts of the song i've tested it already <laughs> Mm. Wait, did I pop out the chat? I think I forgot to. <gasps> I I did forget. Okay, hold on. Okay, it's now popped out. Um, yeah, Pepper Day and Pocky. Yeah, so basically, like right now, convenience stores will have like a bunch of like even like huge sizes of like Pocky boxes, like just gigantic ones. And, you know, I don't know, you just buy them for your friends, your loved ones, and it's adorable. So cute. Uh, Tita, can you read Korean? Yes. Whether or not I will understand it is up to whatever is being written, but I can read it. It's like the easiest language to learn how to read, actually, did you guys know? You can learn to read it in like two days. Mm-hmm. Don't they also celebrate Valentine's different? Yeah, they have a single day where you eat like black bean noodles. Um, they have black day, white day, and either one is like where the guy gives girl chocolate and the girl gives guy chocolate. But I don't remember which one's which. Yeah. Hmm. Oh. Rudy, thanks for the 25 gifted. What the heck? Thank you. Thank you so much. Do you want to visit the Philippines? I've visited the Philippines like three separate times. My best friend in high school was Filipina. So I've been to multiple cities and stuff. How do you think I know what Jollibee is? <laughs> I have a picture of me posed next to the bee because I have like a big little jelly statue. I think it was in vanilla when I did it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and instead of going to my um senior prom, I went to her debut instead. Which is like, you know, um... For those that don't know, it's it's like it's like their version of Sweet Sixteen, kind of you know. It was awesome. I loved it. She was so pretty. She looked like a princess. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 18th birthday. I meant to say it was like a. It, sorry. I, I'm not. I wasn't saying it was the 16th birthday. I meant to say it as in like, like Sweet Sixteen in the sense that they celebrate it like the same way like it's like big like a big ball type thing yeah bear bub hello bear bub yo what are you drinking you guys know ryan higa he makes energy drinks so it's called ninja milk and this is like their lemon iced tea flavor and usually i think energy drinks are really like aggressive like you know how they're like you know how there's like monster and then there's like a white monster i would always opt for the white monster because it's like less aggressive on my taste buds it's like you know so yeah it's like it's like gentle it's like a iced tea flavor but carbonated it's like yummy and it actually gives me like it ha any nostalgia from hockey oh no you know, will you play Minecraft DSMP today? I'm scared I'll be lonely. And like, I feel like I don't have a plan. Like I, I want to get on and like, I want to make a house and stuff. You know, do you have a Korean name? No, I don't. I was kind of sad that I didn't get one. Hmm. Uh, 
um, I always pick the white monster. Yeah, I like like more gentle energy drinks. You know what I mean? I, at first, I was never like an energy drink person. Um, but then I think like I started drinking like some white monsters because of someone, <laughs> and I was like, oh, I guess energy drinks aren't that bad. And then I, I drank some like G Fuel because like, you know, all my friends are <laughs> sponsored by G Fuel. And I was like, all right, I can do whatever. Uh, I would gladly pay, play Minecraft for RC. Kylie, honey. Oh my God. Yeah, the OTV one. Um, I haven't downloaded all the mods for that, so I can't play that right now. But I, I do want to download all this stuff. It's just, it's just so, it just takes so long to get in those games. I don't know why. Have you tried Yerba Mate? No, I haven't, but Ray suggested that one to me. Can you see my plushie in the back? Yes. There's Chunky Pikachu. Or Bear. And, uh, Puppy Cat. And these are my candles. They look kind of nice. Of course, pulls on me, bully. I'm at Whole Foods. And I'll do it again. What the fuck? Oh. Can we play Tax Evasion? I'm surprised you remember me playing that game. This, this song is a cat jam. This is the pun song. Those are candles. Yeah, they're 100% decorative though. I don't think I'll ever light them, like ever. Especially because I can't imagine they would smell the best, but. Play unpacking. My problem is my internet's so bad that I have to download games before I stream them. Uh, are you gonna decorate your room more? I kind of like how empty it is. It's like less distracting. I don't, right? I don't know. Maybe we could put some furniture in it, but... Sometimes I like simplicity. I didn't forget Hollow Knight. We could play Hollow Knight. Hmm. Is it the same Whole Foods where you beat him up in the parking lot? Exactly. Tina's the type of person to pretend like she's smoking when she eats Pocky. It's so true though. I'm like... Did you not wash your hair? I did wash my hair this morning. Does it look greasy? Ah! Corpse! He to beat my ass in a Whole Foods parking lot. And I'll do it again. Fry me. Um. Mm. Corpse, it's Pocky Day. Did you know? 11 11. Hmm. Mm, yum, yum, yum. Dude, your hair is so long. It used to be longer. But now I just feel, um, I don't know. Corpse, you wanna go on the DSMT? <laughs> Avalon Raptor, thanks for the 365. Thank you. Wait, what'd you say? What'd you say? Mm, you said, um, hi, Tina, it's my birthday today, and I was wondering if I could get a happy birthday from you. <gasps> happy birthday, Avalon Raptor. Happy birthday. <laughs> Corpse, tell her to sing Prima Donna. Corpse is the only reason I sang it that one time. Mm. I really need to go see a dentist again. It's so hard finding time for the dentist though. It is, it's hard. Mm. Does she wear contacts? No, my eyes are just brown. I don't know why I said brown like that, but they're brown. I, guys, my favorite type of like eye color on like gals is like just black, like big old black eyeballs. They just look so shiny and glossy and they look like puppy eyes. <laughs> they're just so cute. It's adorable. Mmm, Tina, I have listened to you to the prima donna clip every day. Why? Why?
Why don't you listen to Marina sing and she does a much better job? <laughs> Please, please give me an ad lib. I sound just like it. I sound just like the clip it. Please. Show us the Jollibee picture. I don't know where it is. I'm gonna be honest. And I was also like young. Or look kind of weird. I think my feet. My feet's in it. I don't know. Tina ad lib. <laughs> what song is this? It's Turn Back Time. The Carl song by Derivacat. What does hockey taste like? Chocolate and breadsticks. It's just addicting to eat, like the action of it. I don't know how to explain it. It's just so little, you know? Tina, are you going to play DSMP stream? I would love to do that. I just don't have a plan. Um, Carl's song? I thought this was yours. What do you mean, my song? <laughs> hmm.